Hi, I'm Dan with FreshPoint, and I wanted to take a few minutes to talk about the basics of avocados with you. Avocados often get a bad rap because they're a pretty expensive fruit. There are ways to work around that. There are three families of avocados. There's Mexican, Guatemalan, and the low-fat Caribbean or Florida avocados. The Florida avocados are the only ones that have a USDA grade standard. They have a number one and a number two. The Mexican Guatemalan and Mexican Guatemalan hybrids don't have a USDA spec, but they do have an industry established grading system. We have a number one and a number two. The grade is based on external factors only. Uniformity of shape, consistency of color, and lack of scarring. There is a price difference between number ones and number twos, but there's no difference on what's inside. They'll both have the same rich, buttery flesh that everybody loves with an avocado. So you may want to consider saving some money by choosing the right grade. Avocados come in different sizes, anywhere from a 32 to a 70 count. There's even a new flex pack. And that's simply the number of avocados per 20 pound case. So again, like every other fruit, the lower the number, the bigger the avocado, and the bigger the price tag. So if you're making guacamole, you may want to consider using a 70 count number two. A little bit will go a long way. The Haas avocado accounts for 95% of all the avocados grown in California. This avocado was developed by a postman named Rudolf Haas. It's the industry standard. It performs well, it ripens great, it grows fast just an all-around perfect avocado. California is the leading producer. There are many varieties grown, but the Haas reigns supreme. Florida or Caribbean avocados are a little different. They never turn black when they're ripe. They stay green. They actually have a lower fat content, so they're not as rich and don't have that nice buttery flavor of a regular avocado. So how do you know when your avocado's ripe? Well, a lot of the times the skin will tell the tale. A number one stage is 100% green, has no give when you apply gentle pressure to the stem end. As you let your avocados warm up, don't store a green avocado in the refrigerator, it'll never ripen. They'll start blushing black, you'll get less green. You'll start to get a little give. Then they'll go full black. At this point, little gentle pressure by the stem, it yields, you know it's ripe and ready to go. You don't want to get your avocados too cold. They will show some chill damage. Sometimes when you cut an avocado, you'll see spots in it, little brown spots. It's indicative of late season fruit that may have been held on to a little too long. More than likely, it's chill damage. But don't fret, just scoop the little brown spot out. It doesn't affect the quality or flavor of the avocado. I'm Dan, and that was the basics of avocados.